you are now tuned in to the network, the YouTube channel that takes complex networking topics and dumbs them down to a more simpler language. Today's topic is section 6.5B, DHCP options. Notice there's in brackets or parentheses here, it says describe, right? So we're not going to do any hands-on today. We're just going to describe what DHCP options are. This is a topic in the CCMP route exam. It'll be known as CCMP Enterprise come February 24th, 2020. Let's go ahead and take a look at the exam blueprint, see where we came from, where we headed. Hashtag lab every day. All right, this is the exam blueprint implementing Cisco IP routing, exam code 300, 101. We just configured and verified DHCP server client and relay, right? Today, we're going to just do DHCP options and describe. So let's just run through this real quick because this should be a quick one. This is actually a really deep subject if you really want to go there, right? But we're not going to. <laughs> I'm just not going to do that. If you want to, you can read this stuff on your own, but we'll briefly describe what they are. DHCP, you know what DHCP is, right? Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol. It's a way to hand out IP addresses to devices that need them. It allows the devices to get them automatically, right? Without any user intervention. Now it'll take user intervention to set it all up, but after that, it's, it's hands-free, right? Now, and obviously those devices need IP addresses to communicate on the network, right? Now, when we give them IP addresses, we can also give them other information, right? Those other informations are called options. Let's take a look at this slides real quick for some information. All right, if you remember a couple months back when we discussed DHCP, right? We talked about the IP header, right? There's also the DHCP header that gets tacked on to your requests, right? So, or even on your replies as well. But anyways, this is the DHCP header. When, whenever you got a discover message, an offer message, a request, acknowledgement, this header gets tacked on along with it, right? We talked about, you know, whether it's going to be a one through four over here, how many hop counts it is away. You know, if you need a relay agent, your IP address, when you obtain one will be there. We got the server host name, all of this other stuff, right? Well, well, if you remember from that video, I said there's also an options field right here that's in the bottom of the gray, right? There are so many options. Not only do we give them an IP address, we can also tell them what DHCP server to use, what, what their lease time will be. We can also tell them what their DNS server will be. We can give them all kind of options, right? It's just like adding more information, more options to your car, right? You want power windows? Okay, fine. You want sunroof? Okay, fine. Nowadays, those are pretty standard, right? But that's how old I am. It wasn't standard back then. Official definition, DHCP options. DHCP allows for other options besides IP addresses to be handed out to clients. DHCP version 4 can hand out default gateway, DNS service, etc. What is the etc.? I will show you. But I will also show you how deep this subject can be. Note that DHCP version 6 does not hand out IP, that's for IPv6, right? Does not hand out gateway information because that is done by RAs, right? What is that? That believes that's router advertisements, if I'm not mistaken, right? Some common DHCP options. We got option 3, default gateway. So we know that we usually give that out when we do. We say default gateway, and then we give them a default gateway. That's option 3. Remember in the last video what the pop quiz was, right? That's option six, DNS servers. I gave you guys an IP address and I and I asked for the domain name of that. That was your pop quiz for the last video. We could also give a host name, domain names, NTP servers, least time information. All of these are options, but believe it or not, there's way more options than this, right? These are the common ones. Take a look at this guide right here, right? This is from the Cisco website, right? DHCP options. This book is 36 pages long, right? Of just, you know, general, you got one page of generic information, RFCs and and information about DHCP 4 and 6, right? But then you also have the options right here. All of these options. That's why in that video I said we're not going to cover all of that because there's just so many options that you could add to DHCP. And that's probably the reason why in this exam they said just describe it because this alone could be a, a, you could do a whole course on just DHCP options. Obviously, we're not going to do that. So let's just pick one. For example, we've got this just the common one. Name server option. It's option five right there. We got option three right here, which is router, which sometimes you can call it default gateway, right? Subnet mask. We can give subnet mask information. That's option one right there, right? That's these are most these are not your most common ones, but probably that is a common one. And again, those are so many options that you can give out. Now that's just the DHCP version four or IPv4 version, right? Let's say DHCP version six. We go to DHCP version six right here, page fourteen. Look at all these options that you can add for DHCP version 6, DNS servers, that's common one right there, right? NIS servers, the network information services, servers right there, right? One more information on that, look up that RFC. Uh, we got the DNS name information right here. 
blob, whatever that is. Bruh. And uh, we just got so many options when it comes to DHCP version 6. We're not going to discuss all of them. I'll leave a link in the description below if you want more information on these options. That is all I got for y'all today. That is my YouTube page. That is my Twitter handle. Go ahead and add me on Twitter. Leave a comment below if you want more information. Again, I'll leave a link in the description below. There's no pop quiz for today. This is just a quick rundown of what DHCP options are. For now, please comment, like, subscribe to the network. Bruh, 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 bruh.